my years as a, a forest trader, one of the things I've discovered uh, why many people fail when it comes to trading is that people thought that trading is one of the best way to make money but it's a surprise that the more they keep thinking the more they are trying the more they are losing listen every business is a business each time you talk about money making ventures it, once it is money it can never be easy get that in your mind some of you went to school you studied uh, your, from your own faculty or department you graduated you went to a company you look for job they offered you a job and uh, what is happening you are working in that company and while you are working in that company, you don't want to make mistake because there is an agreement in salary or stipend or anything at all. They are paying you and for that reason, you go to work by 7 or 8, you stay there 5, 6, you pay great attention to what you are um, uh, meaning in your working place, you take orders, you take instructions. You deliver the job accurately. Sometimes they promote you. At the end of the month, you receive your salary. Now you are making money. Then that money may not be enough for you. Then you saw an app or an advertisement or anything that called that is called forest. As you heard about it, they told you that forest trading is simple. And now you were paid, for example, you were paid one thousand dollars two hundred dollars any amount you are paid but it is for a long period of time and caution is applied now you have seen forests and you think that is something you wake up is something that the organizers or the ceos they think they just want to dash people money that is why people fail they have a wrong mindset about forests they, they have a wrong perspective about forests, and that is why many are losing out. That is why many are shedding tears. Some are looking at forests today as a scam. Some say that they manipulate market. Some say that, uh -uh, that I was sure that this is correct, but later it didn't work out that way. The reason is very simple, and I want to correct that mindset from you now listen before you trade if once as you're watching this video before you trade again this is one of the things i have shared with my students in the mentorship class before you trade again who is your mentor one number two are you applying a little part of what we are doing in your job are you applying half of it to this trading business without noticing great success? Just simple question. You, you sacrifice your whole week. You are paid. You sacrifice your one month. You are paid. But you wake up with your phone, your laptop, you place a trade, thinking to make millions. Ask yourself that question. After being a graduate, you went to the office, sometimes they send you to another part department for training or you come to that place for training for weeks. After all this training, the question is, why are they training you so that they will not hear stories when you resume work? But all of them are money making ventures because you work for them to pay you. But each time you see a strategy on YouTube, you rush down, you place a trade, you are gone, the money is gone, you borrow again or you invest again, the money is gone. Ask yourself a question. What is really the problem? The 
problem is not that the forest is not paying. The problem is that you lack the proper discipline. That is it. You lack the proper discipline. You keep doing everything you are doing in that your office, in that your career, yet you are getting a positive result. Ask yourself, what are you doing with forest? Have you ever traded with caution before? Have you ever seen an opportunity in forest trading but you are not sure and you leave it? Have you ever applied what great people, people who trade, who use forest as business, have you ever asked them what is their secret? No, you want to be a boss of your own and this is how you are losing out. My name is GDFX. I care for you so much and I don't want you to lose out and I don't want you to keep packing loans for yourself instead of growing you are decreasing that is not the wish of every man or any man on earth so I want to give out this strategy why am I saying this thing people who are supposed to grow are going down instead of you to grow your account you are blowing your account it's wrong See, in the history, nothing succeeds until you invest your time in it. Invest your time in it. You spend 31, 26 solid days in your working place. You spend three seconds analyzing a market that should give you money. And you think you can fail. It's wrong. Now look at the screen. Look at the screen. This strategy is going to be very simple and short. I know why I spend this time. I know people don't like things like this. All they want is go straight to the point and give us the strategy. We know it. Since you know it, how far? And you know why? People that have helped me grow, I don't want to see them go down. I love to grow together with everybody. If I have seen you, I would like to see, like I was in Patakot, some part of Nigeria here. So I had a, a seminar with some people on this forest. When I was looking at them, they were doing well. So when I introduced candlestick pattern, I noticed that half of them, short, almost all of them are not interested in learning candlestick pattern. They thought I was coming to do a magic. They thought I was coming to ask them, I place trade. What are you going to do with placing trade? And all I did to convince them that this, that, that this is the principal thing, they never believed me. Maybe they were saying in their heart, this guy is not serious. Maybe because they had a mind of entering market with maybe 50 loss side. And as I know some of them will be hearing me and they know that I'm talking to them. Please. Don't fall a victim of that. And till now, I can tell you, I spent like two days in that place. Or let me just call it a day. I pour my heart to make these people understand the secret of forest. But they never believed me. The order we are talking is that they need money. That they need money. That they need money. And that is why many are losing out. You needed money, that is true. And you discover that forest trading is one of the easiest way. And sometimes people will come to me and say, give me a signal. I can't say no. But one thing I will tell you is that I don't have the time. And that is true. Because by the time I will be taking my time to analyze my trade. Sometimes if I analyze my trade and place it. Listen, if I analyze my trade and place it on, let's assume, four hours. That four hours, the only money that can carry the signal on four hours is from five hundred to four hundred dollars. Maybe you have fifty dollars, and before the market to make a move from my four hours movement, your you with fifty dollars you are out of the market. And some management I am handling are not and not anything less than five hundred. So if I see a signal on four hours time frame or one hour time frame and I entered it, I can enter up to four market, I mean four accounts at the same time. And I let them, it can take up to 20 minutes before it will start giving me profit. Can you handle it? So if I accept you and 
I will go to four minutes. Then what gives me profit in one hour time frame may not give me profit from five minutes. That is such a simple trip. People don't know it. So before you know it, you are out of the market. And what you'll be hearing is GDFS. GDFS is a scam. GDFS is not serious. GDFS don't know what he's doing. And sometimes they will convince you to go for robots. And you go for robot. Do you think that these people will create what will destroy them? Let me stop there so far. And I know that a word is enough for the wise. Please listen. This strategy I'm dropping out here is very simple. It's not anything serious. It's just as simple as that. You have our alligator in the screen and a moving average in the screen. And down below here is what we have, the indicator window one. Now, listen, for you to enter this trade and make good profits, one, check your one hour time frame. That is the accurate, the one of, let me just use our, excuse me, <clears throat> let me just use our general language, perfect time frame. But you know too well that there's nothing like perfect time frame for any trade. You use the higher time frame to confirm your lower time frame. Now, this, let me just show you this thing. I don't want to talk about this now, but let me just show you this thing now. This very thing you are seeing here now, these two candles you are seeing on one hour time frame is the reason why five minutes time frame has this reversal here is the reason why this time frame has this thing here are you getting it so if you discover such an opportunity in your one hour time frame it gives you a clearer view of entering for spike confirming it from your one hour time frame then using your five minutes as your entry point that is how simple it will be. Then how else will you know that it is going to reverse completely? Each time this thing touches here on 90 levels, two of them will come together. The first one, the yellow and the pink will meet together. Then how will you know it has started reversing completely? The yellow will be under, like this one, Will be under why the pink will be on top i mean the yellow will be under why the green the pink will be on top so anytime you notice something of this nature be rest assured that something is coming then on the main chart how will you know everything will cross this the spike i mean the candles will be under why all of them will be on top for spike for spike everything will cross together all of them will cross together look at what i mean all of them will cross together here and the spike the candles will be under this is for spike until this thing crosses over to this place again the spike has not finished like here now is doing a little consolidation this consolidation is doing that is as a result of a candle in one hour time frame so if this thing should spike down now and open another candle like this as it is dropping that is how the candles in five minutes in five minutes time frame is dropping so that thing that looks like a consolidation is a result of this thing is going and is dropping is going and is dropping going is dropping so it has not making a clear decision of whether to be a spike or a downtrend i mean a scalping movement so what you need to do now is for you to stay clear and watch this thing. But using this one hour time frame, you notice that this thing has curved down like this. This thing has curved down like this. So, but this thing does not give you a right for you to enter for skyping. I mean for spike because it's going to drop. If this thing should look at it, you notice that I marked something here. This is how we we'll do. I marked something here because for those who were in our class last time, for those who were in our class in our last uh, live training session you notice that i told you something of this nature 
about this week candles, these two week candles. You notice what happened? That as it happened this way, market dropped down like this. Do you see it? So each time I notice this, what did I do? I dropped, I dropped this horizontal line. So as this market is growing like this, if this market should cross this very horizontal line, and that is how we do analysis. It's as simple. You just get the knowledge and you trade. So if this thing should cross this horizontal line now, which means it has breaking out from these previous resistance levels, and the candlestick is showing me a signal that sellers is going to take place because buyers tried here and fell tried again and fell. This is where they pushed it and later left it with this hammer. And now this one tried again and fell. Buyers tried again and fell. So now that we have two weak candles on top here, it's showing me that sellers is going to take over. And I said, okay, for me not to be, for me to be sure, let me place this horizontal here. So as I place this horizontal here, and I notice that the signal is showing me that this thing, I have a resistance zone here. So I thought I have a support zone here. So if this thing can spike and cross this thing from my one hour time frame, which means sellers has getting a momentum to push through, that is how market works. So by the time it has reached to this place, watch this place now. This thing has touched here. Do you see it? It has touched here. So as it has touched here, there is nowhere it will go again. Now it has reached 90. The only thing it can do is just to go to this place for a little time and it will drop. So this is what just happened. So the question is, in such a case, what should I do? What you should do is to allow this bullish movement to take a decision of its own. But for clearer understanding, you go to your one hour, your four hours time frame to see what is opening. If you, as, as you can see this thing here, you notice that what opened up here now from the four hours time frame, please listen, I'm teaching you. I'm not just, my interest is not just to give strategy, you watch, move, you watch, and uh, you go, no, listen, from this angle, now you notice that what opened up here now is a bullish candle, and this is a bullish candle, so as it opens up now, you can not say that this thing must get to this place and cross here before you enter your trade. What you need to do is, if this thing should continue this way, if this thing should continue this way, please, I beg you. In your five minutes time frame or one hour um one minute time frame you may see opportunities for like 10 candles five candles but it's not advisable for somebody who wants to succeed in forest trading then what you need to do is if this thing should pull down now and cross this place and cross this place and cross down to this place what it means is that for this thing to pull down to this place you have taken if you have followed my one hour time frame analysis, if you have followed my one hour time frame analysis, you notice that this very candle here now will pull down and break out from this resistance level here. And if it crosses to this place, before it crosses here, you can take your first TP here. You can take your first TP at this very place. Please remember that this thing I'm doing, you are not doing it the same time with me. Discover such opportunity in your forest trading. So the signal, the strategy I'm giving out to you is place these strategies on your phone or on your PC. Each time you notice such an opportunity, then do the same thing I'm doing. You'll get the same results I'm getting. That is how simple markets can be. And remember that this thing can delay. But the delay doesn't make the market manipulative. But instead, it makes the market to be gathering momentum for a positive move. So what do you do? What makes you a forest trader? is the ability for you to locate and discover that movement at the right time and place your trade and before you know it you are enjoying the trade that is how simple it can be now look at this thing let me give out the indicators please listen please listen my name is jdfs and each time i'm talking to you i'm not talking i know that there are many who depend on our videos for them to trade and that is why i am too careful in whatever i'm doing i'm not giving out strategies that is not working if the strategy is not working for you, know it too well that it's not the fault of the strategy. It depends on the knowledge you all have towards forest trading. And let me tell you, please listen and listen very good. Before you place a trade, be sure. Even if you want to try, make sure you have a capital. Don't use your last cobalt to go and try. 
instead try this on your demo apply every every psychological attention you needed for life trade apply it on your demo that is one of the best way to be disciplined in forest trading all right so now look at how do you use this strategy to trade like i've said earlier now take each time you see that this yellow the yellow indicator window one is on top it's a sign of skyping and the pink is below and the pink is below i think i should make the this thing to be more bold so that you will get me look at it so anytime you notice that this thing has touched this place if you can be patient and notice and wait for this complete reversal in your trading career you will be surprised the massive response you'll be getting you will enter for skyping you without fear though it may be skyping it may be spiking small small but it cannot take you out from the market why because you did your analysis and you are sure what is this thing represent this will represent a reversal in a trend which means the market that was once selling now reverses to go for a buy what does it mean in a local term for those who are in mentorship class? It simply means that buyers are taking position. From this place, sellers we are taking, and to this place now, buyers now taking over. So, and sellers cannot allow buyers to rule all throughout the day. What they'll be doing, they'll be interrupting the movement of the market. They will be coming to sell. They will be coming to sell. Why buyers? Once the buyers are more than sellers, sellers don't have choice than to give way. So each time two, three, four sellers gather themselves, they will try to buy. Buyers say no. Sorry, they will try to sell. Buyers say no, we are still in the market. And each time they sell, the market will drop. And while they drop, buyers will continue. That is what brought about the spike and the skyping. You expected it to spike. It didn't spike because buyers has, um, I mean, still have momentum to trade. So don't look at forest as something that you can just imagine. And why imagining it, you may be right. No, you don't say you may be right. Be right. Don't do you may be. You may be right. So that is how market works. So as this thing has touched this thing, like now, like now, this is not my time for trading. I will have entered a trade here because it's going to drop. If it didn't drop now, it will drop later. But why I will not enter here now is that the thing has not made a move so each time this thing made a move and cross to 80 if this thing eventually spike now and get to this place this thing will cross down to 80 so as it crosses to 80 the first tp is here and while that tp is there it has touched 50 after 50 it can reverse and start going like this but if it didn't reverse the last tp is your 20 then where when will you enter for skyping skyping i mean taking pills Number one is anytime you notice, let me show you, anytime you notice something like this, if the market spikes, spiking, skip, skyping, I mean spiking to this place, to this direction, as it crosses 20, enter spike. Watch it, 20 here and here. Look at what happened to this direction. That is how simple it can be. I can't deceive you. I know what I'm telling you. It's as simple as that. Please follow these simple strategies and apply the wisdom you have already and thank me later. Don't be deceived. Sorry that the video is too long. I just want to pour my heart to help you out. That is how simple it can be. As you can see, the market is boiling. It's boiling. Look at it. It will go and it will spike. It will go and it will spike. What is this? What this thing is doing is that it may be that at the result of this place, it's going to leave this thing as a weak candle. I mean... This thing that I've reached here, it may spike and continue like this to leave it as a weak candle like this or something like this, giving it more, more conviction for a powerful downtrend. That means in five minutes time frame, we'll call it a continuation of reversal point, which means a continuation of downtrend. But from this thing you are seeing below here now, from this thing you are seeing below here, it's showing you that this market is going to go up. But why? You see that it has not started going up is because it has not touched 20 if this thing manages to touch 20 watch it will break out from all this resistance zone 
and this yellow 21 moving average the market will be on top of it and once the market is on top of it the market is showing you buy 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 and once it is buy 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 you can't stop it just look out for a positive a positive um a positive resistance zone and close your trade before it touches that place before it will drop that is how safe market can be please watch on the screen i'm going to give out the movies um the indicators number one moving average is 20 that yellow line you are seeing there is 21 moving average in any indicator i'm using you know i am too confident enough in my moving average because moving average gives me the signal i am looking at for resume my candlestick pattern so the second one the second one is alligator five five eight five five three exponential close the three colors is involved please use it this way you can screenshot it and save it carefully okay do you see what i'm showing you can you see it look at it can you see it the market has started sparking like i told you that what you are seeing that place is maybe as a result so that it in will do this now look at what i'm telling you earlier we don't exaggerate here look at it here if this thing crosses this 80 here now it's an opportunity for me to enter trade maybe by then i will have been this video may be over so that i'll have my time to trade do you see it that is how simple market can be there is nothing like foul play or manipulation in tariff so far this is um, parameters uh, relative strength in the seven close p01 please use your background color and make sure you apply make sure you set up those things it will help you 1020 is for you to sell i mean it's for you to buy in in crash please it's for you to sell and crash then 90 80 is for you to sell you see it and crash all right this is 21 that is the same thing you have on this thing this is second move this is the first moving average in indicator window one please set it that some way and uh, the last one is 50 you may ask me why do i use 15 i use 50 to look higher than trend which means that if this 21 and 50 will have an agreement to touch here the moving average the main chart don't have choice than to obey because this is what has happened in a period days of 21 and 50 days so something is changing in the system now for move for the level um, for zoom level i am using zoom level this is the last zoom level for the smallest now i'm using zoom level one two and three you can use this one but for clearer analysis use zoom level two please use zoom level two level two then use zoom the final zoom level which is at that level four or thereabouts use this zoom level for you to confirm if this thing has truly touched this place please use it and confirm it please remember that this strategy can work for um crash 500 boom 500 boom uh crash 1000 anything boom anything crash it was for it but 1300 it was with the same way we apply it the same way the same time frame and i said earlier that the time frame is one hour and five minutes you use your one hour to see the complete movement in this strategy then you use your five minutes to confirm it then listen to me in spite of any time frame you are using don't fail to visit your higher time frame of like four hours and listen to see what is happening because even if you use your one hour to trade and the four hours or day trend is saying something else you may not respond the way you are taking it so this is how it works if you need mentorship please feel free to contact me and remember that is not free no business is free we paid for it and we will collect from others that is how life is it's better to be a master of your own have the right knowledge for you to trade by yourself and sometimes signals is good but most times it's better for you to trade anytime you want 
that maybe while you were sleeping you woke up you see three signal to trade and why you you are not there to trade it so what happens nothing so your money will be wasting if possible so please subscribe to my channel and please share this video to your friends and loved ones and i want to specially thank you i mean you you that is watching this video now you are so special to me without somebody like you there is nobody like you dear face i am what i am because i have something i have somebody like you on youtube and to my returning subscribers you are unique you are special gdfs loves you so much and i owe you my attention that is why i've never seen anybody who sent me a message on whatsapp that i've never replied even if i have not replied it in two weeks i must reply okay so please feel free to contact me i am not a hard man i can never be a hard man the only thing is that we apply streets and uh, the question of our businesses so stay tuned and keep enjoying the forest life and please call me one day and say i have received i have been trading today i've made my first one million dollars in forest trading and i'll be happy to hear that so thank you and bye bye